Hello, hello, this is Mystic. This is Mystic, yes. Let's get right in it. So excuse me if I'm extra giggly today. Excuse me, please, because I've been trying to like just laugh because people is really funny and they trying to be a full distraction, trying to distract me from what I'm doing. But the energies, yes, the energies, yes, the energies, yes, of today is damn, Megatron, didn't you get rid of me? Didn't you didn't want me? Now you watching and hawking and stalking me. What is that all about? Please. So those are the energy of the day. The Decepticons. The ones that wanted to throw you away like some trash. The Decepticons that wanted to act like you didn't exist and wanted to choose you over another is now all up and through your business. E. Wanting to know what's going on with you. Minding your business. Who your friends. Who your friends' friends. Who you being around. All of those things. So Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, yes. We would like to know. What is the chakras for today? Because I am extra hype for what is going on and I have not had no coffee. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come to you today. What is the energies? What is the chakras of today? Yes, what is the chakras of today? And I think I got to take that out. Oh, the, uh, the, uh, the chakras is the day to watch your back. Keep that third eye open. Keep that tuition going. Yes, all these things. The call of the day is the third eye chakra. Yes, and speaking of the third eye chakra. My canes has this. Quite has this in it. Yes, this has the, the Amherst and the Lapridite. This is why. I made this protection candle and includes these crystals in this candle because this is my protection candle for the third eye and it also represents um the green uh heart chakra yes so anyway today's chakra is the third eye chakra and the characteristics of the, the, the third eye chakra influences thought, spirituality, wisdom, clairvoyance, and imagination, and, and produces and enhances psychic awarenesses. Yes, the, the aromatherapy for the third eye chakra is sage, rosemary, pine, lavender, cypress, and juniper. Yes. The spur guys that represents the third eye is Archangel Raphael. The sound of the third chakra may sound like, hey. That is the sound of the third eye chakra. And the stone for today that represents the third eye chakra is the Amherst, the Blue Tiger, the Leopardite, and the green tourmaline. Yeah, so these are the, my protection candles that I have available on my Etsy shop. Yes, but today, yes, we're going to do chakra first. And I'll do the daily at the end. All right, so Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come to you today because we want to know why is these niggatrons that did... Why is these niggatrons, you know, those that was Decepticons against the Divine Feminine, you know, those that had a whole lot of things that they didn't want Divine Feminine, they didn't want her to be around, they didn't want to be with her, they wanted to pick old comics over them and all those things, you know, those types. But now that they see Divine Feminine getting on with her life and doing her, now they want to hot trot it on back over here. What is those energies of today, Divine Feminine? Why do they want to come back over here with Divine Feminine? Okay, so the first, in, mm, so the first energy why they want to come back down the dead because they see you are Empress. They see you living that empress life. They see you are strong. They see you are grounded. They see you are spiritual. 
They see you are a woman that can handle your business doing adversity. They see you are an empress, one that can handle her finances, one that can maintain a household, one that is mature and grounded and shows her spirituality. What is the other energies that they see? That now you didn't want me, you Decepticon, now you watch me. Yes, yeah, the other energy that they see, honey, they see you in the chariot energy, baby. They see you got in your little Uber car, or you pushed it out in your little Honda Accord, darling. And you got in your chair or your little riverboat and you went down screaming down, uh, you know, uh, the Potomac River and one of them little riverboats to make it on down to the other side to Virginia. Yeah, mm-hmm. You did a water taxi, darling. You got in your little water taxi and moved it forward towards your moving. You got your confidence up. Now you determined, you got your goals set, you doing things for you, and you showing victory in this chariot energy because you decided to ride it out in your little Uber car and push it on down the river. Yes, and now that you done pushed it on down the river, you have achieved self-control, that adversity that you was in, you are no longer in it, and you looking in your mirror of your chariot, darling, you have no time to look in your past, darling. Hmm. Because your ponytail is swinging in the wind and you have no time to look backward. You are moving forward toward your future in your chariot. What is the other energy, darling, dear? Why these people that didn't want you, now they want to watch you. Yeah, they want to watch you, girl, because they see you showing strength. You you stand it in your power, darling, dear. You are tolerance. You are showing endurance in this adversity that they put you in, darling. They put you in this adversity. However, you have gotten over this adversity and you are standing strong. Hmm. You are not going through problems. You are straining through strength. When you make decisions, they are ones that affect you and others around you. And you are making sound decisions and giving sound advice. Okay? Okay? Yes. You are making sound decisions and giving sound advice. Go, girl. In your energies, in your chariot, in your strength. Yes, you are showing it. And this is why these people is upset. And this is why these people, these Decepticons, these Niggatrons, is over here minding your business. Yes, you didn't want me, Decepticon. Now you're watching me. Yes, we would like to know what that energy is all about and why are they watching you. Everywhere that I go. People I used to know who don't know me no more. I suggest you lay low. They watch. Yeah, girl, they all up and through your business, girl. They thought they was going to do it up with that other woman and things. They found out that other woman, mm, she ain't doing nothing over there. That's why they want to bring it on back on over there to you. Yes, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, yes, we would like to know. Why does this person want to bring it on back over there to me after they say mean and hateful things to me? I don't want you. Ooh. Okay, what up? Them two wanted to fall. Yes, I don't want you. I got somebody better than you. Yeah, we want to know. We want to know what's the deal, Pickle. You know what I'm saying? Why they want to come back over here to me? What is the deal, Pickle? Why they want to um act like I'm that prize when they wanted to get rid of me, talk about me, you know, throw salt on my grain, you know, all those hateful things that they wanted to do. And I'm using the daggone what's the tea cards because uh, we want to know what is this tea going on with these people. What is this tea going on with these? I know that is not the tea. Yes, that is not the tea. That is not the tea. Yes, those wanted to come out, so those fell out. But anyway, I want to just do this one more time. 
because something is telling me to do it one more time. What is the tea? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, yes. What is the tea? We is using what is the tea cause, but we would like to know what is the tea? Why is this Decepticon that didn't want me? Now they watching me. Okay, girl, because they was acting fake. Girl, yeah, they found out the first cause that comes out is the reason why this person left you, honey, because the person that they left you for had their mask on and they was acting fake. They showed their representative. So the mas divine masculine thought they had somebody better than you because that person that they had, they found out what is the tea? Oh, the T is they found out that person that they left you for is fake. They were acting fake. And now they found out the real person that they are. This person has took this mask off. Divine Masculine is in the energy where he just wants to leave. That is the T. Yes, just leave. It's not working out, darling. Yes, that is the T. Mmm. Yes, what is, I'm sorry, what is the news? I'm sorry, what is the news? That is these calls, yes. And because this person went over there and they um just don't want to leave, they is in the energy where they over there giving you the evil eye. And darling, our divine saying, don't trust this person. They still have evil-like energies, yes. They wants to come over there and steal your energy. Don't trust them, darling. This person is giving you the evil eye. And they know that you are a loving, giving soul. They want to come over there and steal your energy. So please do not let this person come over there and steal your aura. This next call, they know that they are now dealing with a shady female. They know that this irritates the hell out of them. And all they want to do is scream. Because they now found out that they picked the wrong female. They picked a shady female. So they're now in their feelings, darling. This is why this person is watching you. This person is stalking you. Because they know that the person that they went over there to be with ain't nothing but a piece of drawers. And they ain't a good piece of drawers. Because you see, that's a little dirty in the inside. Them undies. They have Petri dish panties. So they finding out the bra that they left you for. Yeah, she's sneaky. Always going through the phone. Always drunk. And they have inner childhood wounds. So Divine Masculine is finding out that person that he left you for is always going through his phone. Being knee high private eye. Looking for Scooby-Doo mystery shaggy. It was you and those meddling kids. Yes, that's the um energies going on. People is, we are looking for ladders. We are looking for ladders. We are looking for blues clues. Over in the comic community, doom, 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 doom. Yes, they are always in the energy where they looking for blues clues. Going through people's phone. Always drinking. They be drinking. This is the drunk bitch call. This bra is always in the energy. Where she drinking. And getting her damn drink on. And stay lit, 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 lit as fuck. Because she had childhood wounds. And this chick need to seek therapy for them. This is how she get her men. Through sex magic. Yeah, she does the magic with her body because she's a damn mattress bot that's always on a facade. That she can get any man she want with her little extremities. Girl, that is only temporary, darling. Using your little extremities to get you one once and again in your lifetime. You're going to have to use something else beside your brain. Divine Feminine is saying, see, I can't even take you. You did all of this for groupie. You know what I'm saying? You did this for a groupie that stay in an energy that's lit as fuck. Now you want to sit back and reflect. 
that you fucked up. Now you want to sit back and reflect that you fucked with a bitch that had mental health concerns. Now you want to sit back and reflect that this broad is lying and blind come out again. So yes, Divine Feminine know he's dealing with a liar that lies. And has this honesty. He know that this broad is always in the energy where she's lying and crossing her damn fingers. But this is the broad that he picked. He picked this broad that's always in the energy where she's cheating on him. Yes. And he's you he's losing face. He's losing face of the current relationship that he's in. He's losing patience. He's losing face because he sat there and what he thought was a woman that he had. Oh, yes, honey. She sent her representative. Will the real comic please stand up? He's saying the real comic now, honey. And he's going through it because he's losing patience because he made the wrong decision. He made the wrong decision, and now he have to do a side hustle because he broke. So we have Divine Masculine over here driving for DoorDash or Uber Eats trying to make money because he broke it in the back of glass and then trash. And ain't nothing wrong with Uber Eats or DoorDash, but I'm just saying. You want to sit up there and act like you got all this money and be doing all this flexing and things. Now you got somebody straight out of no cash. It's the motherfucking Divine Masculine. Masculine. Come in like a night believing no faster. He'll fuck your sister, fuck your cat. He'll even try your mama, but she wasn't having that. He liked the feeling, like the fuck it. And when he get done, he just say fuck it. He is straight out of no cash. Straight out of no cash. Trying to get himself a side hustle, my dear. To try to get his money right. Mm. Sad situation. But what's even sadder that sex isn't wrong, but you gotta be right. And if you have sex, you better wrap it up tight. Listen to me, cause Mohawk ain't joking. One pump and dump and your ass will be smoking. Yes, this one is always in the energy of SCDs. Only thing make my life complete. You can't sit your ass on the toilet seat. Cause you got a STD. Players want to play. Lovers want to love. I don't even want none of the above. He got a STD. Yes, indeed, he got a STD. He got a STD. Don't see me, boo. You got a STD. Mm. Yes. Don't see me. You got a STD. Cause you went over there with an attention whore. Mm hmm. That whore that stay on the floor doing a little bit of things that strange. For oh, love, he's a chat angel. That one. That's what he got. An attention whore. That's what he got. One that's insecure. That's what he got. Darling, did. This is why he creeping and hawking and stalking on you. Because he took a reality check, darling, did. Mm. And all those hidden secrets. That was revealed, darling, dear. Now he want to cat his ass over there with you. Out of mind saying caution. Avoid sick people. COVID. They still over there gambling. Mm-hmm. They still over there need a detox. A digital detox. Mm-hmm. Because they won't stay out of your business. That's why they need a digital detox. Okay, so. They need a digital detox, darling. Because they over there hawking, stalking. All up and through your social media, darling. Our divine is saying, divine. Stop it, Divine Masculine. Get up out that girl business and go do a digital detox and get yourself together. Yeah, go get yourself together, Divine Masculine. 
Get yourself together. That is not for you. Stay out that girl business. She ain't bothering nobody. Just because your thing ain't right, don't come over there and try to mess up her Earl because you done fuck shit up. Don't do that now. That's being a little selfish. That's being a little careless. But those are the traits that you have. So divine masculine is in the energy where he said, I'm not listening to the divine. I'm not listening to nobody. I want what I want. And I want divine feminine. So divine feminine, I divine is telling you, divine masculine is in a obsession kind of energy. This damn Decepticon, this niggatron that didn't want you, this niggatron that didn't want you is now obsessed with you. This damn niggatron is now obsessed with you. He obsessed with you because you are millennium over there making your money. You are adventurous. You are destroying traditions. And you have a personality. And you're doing you on your own. This person is trying to be a damn Decepticon because they jealous of you. Because you left their ass alone. They want to send hate message to you. They want to move forward and take action. But they're not man enough because they don't have the uh, they they don't have the means to apologize. This is why they feel haunted for the things that they did to you. They haunted by the memories. They having flashbacks. They going through trauma and receiving the side effects. From fucking with you, from hurting you, from having you in grief, from putting you in mind fuckery. They going through it. They haunted. They haunted that they listened to their fake ass friends when they told one to pick the comic over you. But he's a narcissist and that's what they do. And this narcissist is narcissist. It's still doing tarot reads on you to try to figure out what is going on with them. Because they are over there receiving karma for fucking with that karmic. They are receiving karma because they are a fraud. And they picked a bum bitch. They over there receiving their karma because they are now being cyber buddy by the comic and her homegirl. They are now in the energy where they are heartbroken and fucked up. They mad. In their feelings, Divine Feminine, because you over there taking flights, not catching feelings. And you saying, fuck what he's saying. Yeah, fuck what he's saying. Yeah, fuck what he's saying. That's a man you can't raise him. A man you can't raise him. I know you're sick of his playing. But fuck what he's saying. Yeah, fuck what he's saying. Yeah, that's the energy that you in. Fuck what he's saying. I ain't trying to hear that shit. I'm going to say, fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Tell them haters I say. Yeah. Divine feminine in the energy where I am catching flights. Not catching feelings. Yes. This is the making big girl moves call. I'm catching flights. Not catching feelings, darling. Fuck you. You can get the finger. The middle. Warm it up, Chris. I'm about to. Warm it up, Chris. That's what I'm about to do. Warm it up, Chris. I'm about to. Yes. Give you the finger. Warm that motherfucker up. Warm it up, Chris. Warm it up, Chris. Yes, you are a narcissist, darling. This is how you get your females always doing that fake flexing. Yeah, that's you. Then you want to sit over there and be abusive to people and act like a damn tyrant. And act like somebody wants you back. I'm going to need you to get the stepping. Is that what you do, divine masculine? Damn Decepticon, you damn nigga trying all up in somebody's business. Want to sit up there and gossip like a girl. Your ass need to go watch the show, Gossip Girl. She ain't even do all that goddamn talking about people that you did, divine masculine. Mm -hmm. You mad because she picked money over love. You need to stop it, need to give it up. 
Your shit ain't working. It is weak as fuck. You need to stop it. Need to give it up. Give it up. Give it up. Hold up. He trying to put me in entanglements. Bitches doing my spells. I'm sick of that shit. Yeah, the mind masculine thought he was the shit. When he had this old herd of women, whole herd of women that he was lying to, fake flexing, clout chasing, that he had all these things, fishing for comments, fishing for likes online. Yeah, it was all good when your girl was doing my altering beauty spells. Yeah, that comic that was always in the energy of Pele. That comic that was in the energy where she doing tantric sex. But now that she's cheating on you, you feel bounded to this bra. Because she always putting you in the energy of third parties. Now she's putting you in the energy, I'm in your your face being bae. But I'm everybody's bae behind your back. Now she's been the sneaky bitch. Now she has options. Now you in the energy where that bitch is your worst nightmare. Because you got to deal with all of her personality disorders. You have to deal with a toxic lover. Yeah, that will be you. Divine Masculine. This is why Divine Masculine is stalking you because he got a a toxic lover. And this toxic lover is being a toxic lover to everyone else. She's being a mattress back. Meanwhile, you over there living your best life and saying, I don't have time for a confused man. Fuck you. Now you in the energy that she hurt me. Oh, well. You get what the fuck you get. Oh, well, now you looking up symptoms because your ass put me in the same energy of STD. Now you're mad because you feel like Divine Feminine done lost love, done found love. Divine Feminine saying, I don't want to be bothered with your bad habits. I don't want to be bothered with your broke ass. I done stepped my game up. I'm doing me and I'm still unbothered. I don't want to deal with your fake ass. Stay over there with your thought ass bitch. That's always in a thoughtful like behavior. And I'm going to say, if you like my vibe, like, share, and subscribe. But before we roll out, what is the energies? What is the daily messages? Holy Spirit. Decepticons. Somebody asked me the last time what is a Decepticon. Y'all didn't watch Transformers? Okay, so you had the Decepticons that was the fake Transformers that wanted to be like the Transformers. They did everything like them with their evil ass and they was nothing like the Transformers. That's a Decepticon. One that tries to take one's trait and make it their own and be deceptive. But I'm not talking about Decepticons. I'm talking about Niggatrons. Those is the ones, those Negroes, that have them B2-2000 kind of behaviors. Those are the behaviors of the Terminators. You know the Terminator was the B2-2000s. So, the B2-2000s is those comics that act like niggatrons. You know, those that you kept dying. Sir kept trying to kill the damn Transformer. Did he die? No. Anyway, love is love. And whoever abides by love and, and the divine... The divine abides by him, says 1 John 4, 1, 6. What is the other prayer for today? I am your, I am your divine who teaches what is best for you, says Isaiah 48, 17. If you like my vibe, like, share, and subscribe.